Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marquita, and on this video, we're gonna be doing a plan with me in my Fobonichi slash Happy Nichi planner. I have rotated that into my lineup, and we now do that on Mondays or mini Happy Planner Mondays. So that's what we're doing today. But first, if you're new to my channel, I hope you'll stick around and consider subscribing and also giving me a thumbs up on this video if you enjoy it. So let's go ahead and get started. If you want to see a plan with me in this planner, make sure to stay tuned. So first, some exciting news. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know that I launched Fobonichi inserts. So I thought I would show a couple of things to you guys right now, just because why not? So if you are on my Instagram, you've already seen a lot of this stuff. I haven't shown you every single thing in the collection, but it is up and running on my website right now, a littlemissfancyplans.com, which I'll leave a link below. So there are three formats of the Fobonichi inserts. They are printable version, and then I'm also going to be printing them and shipping them, which is crazy. Um, I also have 32 covers in my shop, so I thought I would just show you a couple today. So I thought I would just show you a few. So this is like a marbleized look and all of the covers are front and back. Um, there are a different design. So this is the front design. Then when you flip it open to the inside, that is that um, different design so that you can switch things out. Um, I also have like a lacy look and then similar on the inside, just in a different color. And I've got a ton of these guys on my um, website. So this is just a couple of things that I'm showing you guys. Of course, we've got florals here. And with this floral, I wanted to have this little dashboard um, on the inside so that you can write on it with your white erase marker or your, excuse me, dry erase marker or wet erase marker or Sharpie. And of course my logo's there on the bottom. Um, so there are tons of cute options in my shop. Again, I'm just showing you a few. Um, this has been in the works for some time so I'm super excited to be going live with it and so I thought I would just share with you guys a couple of the cover options so this is my previous Fobonichi with all of the lists that I created I'm working on transitioning that into this Fobonichi because this is all mine and I want to be able to use my own product and so um, I'm working on that but for now I just carry them both so this is a super cute cover and um, so I just kind of keep that nearby but this is the actual Fobonichi that I'm using. This a cute marbleized cover and again, more marble action on the inside. You guys know how much I love marble. And so this is how the format will look. It'll have this, uh, the cover page, which will have the month and the year. And then when you flip it open, this is actually not how it looks. I completely changed this whole thing, but I didn't want to change it for September because I felt like I don't want to waste. Um, but this was the old month on two pages. And then this is how the weekly looks, you guys. Well, no, because I've never done a plan with me on my channel in this, um, you know, newly created version. I also I always just write it in on my own. Um, but basically, I reformatted everything, and so I'll show you October. So October 2019. This is the month on one page, and the weeklies are all the same in both, um, all the layouts. So that is a month on one page and then that's the weekly view. Everything is all dated, so you don't have to date anything. You don't have to draw any lines in. And then I'm gonna show you November. If I have it, maybe I don't, oh, I don't have it because my husband sent it to a friend of ours that lives in our community here in our neighborhood. Uh, he owns a print shop and he's gonna give me some pricing on printing these for me so I don't have to print them here at home. But there is also a month on two pages that looks similar to what I just showed you here. Um, uh, not here, here. But I have two versions of the month on two pages. It looks it looks different. So you'll just have to check my shop out. And I think I'm probably going to do a full video on everything that's included in this new launch in this collection. So stay tuned for that. I also have full paper. So this is all full paper. Everything is printed on high quality paper. It's not your regular printer paper. It's um, 
it's got some weight to it and so all of this is just fill paper there's fill paper with lines there's fill paper with boxes there's dot grid and then there's lined grid and so yeah so it's gonna be super cool you'll um for now it's starting with just three months because uh i don't have i'm still working on the 2020 planner so it's just from october to december that you'll be able to purchase again either digitally where you can print it at home or a printed version where i can ship it out to you and then there is the dot grid so lined grid and dot grid again there's the line grid so i just wanted to show you guys because i'm so excited about it i have been working on it for some time and i'm finally able to get it all launched and ready to go so it's just um, starting with the fobonichi for now and then eventually i'll expand into the classic planner and the mini planner and the big planner so stay tuned for all of that um, i thought fobonichi would be an easy place to start so again this is a plan with me video i just wanted to show you that um, i don't have this dated out because this was like my prototype first ever version and so i didn't date anything out i just wanted to try it out to see if it was something i even wanted to dive into and so um, we are going to go ahead and plan for the week the next week because we're already playing well actually we're planning for this week we're current so i'm pulling out the pages and i'm going to go ahead and pull the stickers i'm using and we're going to get started so i'm going to be using the choose happy sticker book that's one of my all-time faves and we're just gonna go at it. So what I have going on this week is not really much of anything. My typical standard stuff, I'm just looking at my classic planner over here. I do have an Ulta match on Thursday and ministry on Friday. My family, my parents want us to come to Helen, Georgia on Saturday to spend some time with them. Um, and then my normal standard stuff. So let's just go ahead and start planning it out. As you can see, I just want you to see formatting as well. Um, it's not the complete exact size of this Happy Planner sticker, but it, it still works. So I'm gonna put that, lay that down, grab my tool here so I can trim off that excess. take this and pop it in somewhere else so I don't waste it. Okay, I'm just gonna pull one of these coffee cups. Mondays are always tough. For me, at least, just kind of getting things going. And I'm really starting to just really like the size of the Fobonichi. So that's why I decided to incorporate it into my lineup because I just, I love the size of it. And, um, and it's just perfect for planning. It says hello Monday, how about no? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna grab my pen and write some things in. So Monday I do the kids Bible study and typically my Fobonichi is just for appointments. I take it on the go with me and so for errands and just things I need to see on the go. So kids Bible study. I really do need to grab another one of these sticker books because I use mostly all of the florals and things in here and I really need to just grab one more just so I can have it. So I'll probably do that next time I go to the craft store. So I'm just gonna pop some florals in there. And I'm definitely gonna grab my colorful boxes as well so that way I can um, pop a couple of those in there. But first I'm gonna grab a checklist. These are the perfect size. I mean, they don't fit completely. They don't fit completely in here, but they fit good enough to be able to. And this um, planner layout has dot grid inside of the boxes. So that makes it easy for you to bullet journal if you want and line up the stickers. 
so Tuesday is meeting. And you know what? I'm gonna order my groceries. Oh no, I'm sorry. We're, we're yeah, we are planning for the current week. So I'm gonna order my groceries tomorrow. Or I'm gonna pick them up tomorrow because I was a slacker and I didn't pick them up today. But I do have dinner planned for tonight, so all is well. So I'm gonna grab another checklist and pop it in right here. And Friday I have ministry and I don't have anything else planned for now. Okay, so let's see. Do we want to grab one of these weekend banners? I just want to make sure it flows with the color scheme. This little side over here. So my weekend goals or my weekly goals. First, I'm gonna put this sticker that says "Happiness is an inside job" because I love it. And then I'll talk you through some of my goals. I don't feel like I'm gonna need each and every checklist box. Okay, so my ministry is definitely a goal. And I want to do that two times this week, at least. And um, I want to be prepared for all meetings. And those are the only top two things I can think of right now. But I'm going to add to that as the week goes along. I like to typically have them already done. But um, I can't think of anything else just at the moment. I'm gonna put this to-do list sticker on there and then I'm gonna grab some colorful boxes so I can put it in this area. All right, so on Wednesday, I have lunch with Addison. And then Thursday, we have our family worship. And we're doing the magazine study with friends. And I think that's all for Thursday. And then Friday, I already have my ministry. Saturday, ministry as well. And that barbecue with my family. If we decide to do it. And Sunday is our meeting. All right, and I'm just, oh, Alta on Thursday. I probably have to be there at 10 a.m. That's typical. Okay, so let's see what else we want to add decor-wise, then we'll be done. It's so easy to plan in the Sobonichi because it's this does not a lot of space. And so it's pretty simple and straight to the point. And remember, we do have this additional space here on the side. If we want to add any additional notes, we can. So in some spots, I know I don't need any additional space. I'm just gonna add something decorative. These little boxes fit here perfectly. All right, I think I'm good. And it is for the week of the 9th through the 15th. All right, 
right, and I think I pretty much wrote in everything I needed to, and then whatever else I need to write in, I will go back and do that. I have a little checklist here of things that I need to uh, write in. If I just want to just throw some things down here, um, I could do that. And then I have a tracker here to track something important. So um, I will definitely be showing an after the pin spread on my Instagram. So make sure to stay tuned for that. But this is the plan with me for the week, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed it. You got a little inspiration out of it and you found something you want to use in your planner, which means you'll give me a thumbs up on this video and also consider subscribing to my channel still trying to get the gist of this thing and try to figure out how exactly I want to use it but I love having it in my lineup and um, it's great again for an on-the-go purse planner um, like I've been using it so hopefully you guys enjoyed this make sure to let me know if you guys have any questions uh, remember that you know some of the stuff I showed you is not how it actually looks so you'll have to go onto my um, shop and see exactly how these printables looks there are three different versions so if you don't like this well the weekly stay the same but the monthly is different if you don't like this month on two pages there's a month on one page option and there are two month on two page options which look again completely different from this and there are printed versions or you can just download the pdf and print it at home yourself and again don't forget about the covers there are several different options of covers this is a very very thick laminate material so it's going to hold up over time and so I'm excited about this whole thing and hopefully you are as well and um, you will continue watching these Fobonichi style videos I'm enjoying making them so hopefully you guys will come back next week to catch another Fobonichi style video in which case I'll see you then